Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the Dynasty playing cards from Brendan Hong and the Expert Playing Card Company. All right, so what are the Dynasty cards? Dynasty was originally a Kickstarter project, okay? It was successfully funded and there were two decks in this. There was the green and then there was the red. And what this is, is it is a unique playing card series that's inspired by Brendan's Chinese culture, his heritage, and it's designed and illustrated by him completely. And if you remember, uh, Brendan used to work for King's Wild, uh, King's Wild Project with Jackson Robinson. He created the Hive decks, okay? And so what he's done is he's taken the Chinese elements, he's combined it with the uh, traditional style of playing cards, okay, so Suicide King, One-Eyed Jacks, all that, okay, he's taken that, and then this deck is now a fusion of both worlds. So he's making something completely unique. He's infusing, you know, what you, you and I consider traditional playing cards with Brendan's very unique style of illustration. So like I said earlier, there's two decks in this series. There's the Jade Green, which was an unlimited run. He made enough for uh, everyone who backed and then a little extra. And then the red deck, the red deck was a limited run. There was only a thousand of those printed. Both decks have their own unique elements. And I think they appeal to regular playing card users, uh, flourishers, magicians, collectors, you name it. Both these decks were printed from the expert playing cards with their classic finish, and it is a wonderful embossed finish in stock, and it feels great straight out of the box. The cards have a nice spring, they flex well, they feel good, even when they're broken in. All right, so in this deck review, we're gonna look at the red foil deck. Now, this deck has a little bit of a, a flat black paper, but then it's just riddled all over with this beautiful uh, red foil. The front just simply says Dynasty, and then you have that triangle symbol that you'll see throughout the rest of the deck. This side says Dynasty Playing Cards. This side says Designed by Brendan Hong. Top has an original tuck seal that indicates uh, it's numeric out of a thousand. As you can see, this band actually comes down over the bottom and it actually goes over the ad copy there for Brendan and then it continues through the back, so that's kind of cool. Um, the tongue flap is really thick. This is a really thick, sturdy tuck case. I like it. Um, it's got foil work even on the flap there and then when you open it up, you can see all that red foil uh, on the inside of the tuck case. That is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. These cards come from the Expert Playing Card Company and they do come on their classic finish. A lot of people always ask how they feel how these cards handle. Can't really tell you how they handle because you know, that's a subjective opinion, but I can tell you how thick they are. Uh, these are right on the edge of being a casino grade stock. They're just coming over the edge of being casino grade. Um, they're about the same thickness as the White Lions, same thickness as the early Split Spades or uh, some of the Smoke and Mirrors decks. The back design has a nice thick white border, although it is broken by the illustration that kind of pushes to the edges, creates this illusion that the design is actually bigger than it really is. But you'll also see that the illustration breaks all the way to the edge on the top and bottom, and this creates a cigar band look. So uh, you have that when you spread it from left to right, and also when you spread it from top to bottom. Uh, it's a really cool look, and it looks great in fans. And then you can see the back design uh, just has a very simple uh, Chinese illustration. The cards in the red deck have more borders and more ornamentation. Uh, you're also going to get two original jokers with this deck and you can see the ornamentation, the, the framework there uh, uh, illustrated in these jokers. So one of these jokers is red and one of these jokers is uh, blue. So the red joker is a Chinese man and the green joker is a Chinese woman and they are both in formal dress. With this deck, all four aces are exploded. They're big, they're encased in circles, and they have a frame. Uh, the ace there in the center has that same illustration that you see in the back design, and then underneath it, it says 010916, so that was the date that they were created, and Dynasty Playing Cards designed by Brendan Hong. The pips and indices all have a very familiar layout, but all of them have been redesigned and redrawn by Brandon. So you're gonna have that, uh, just his unique illustration, you know, his unique look. He's actually gone through and redone every single uh, design for the four suits, and it has his own original font in the corners. The quartz in this deck are something that I think is really the pinnacle of the illustrations in this. They're really the thing that stands out the most. The illustrations in this are very beautiful, and you'll notice that each little grouping, each little suit, um, they kind of go together, and so they kind of all have the same uh, colorings, and they all uh, either come from the same clan or the same family. I really, really love Brendan Hong's illustration. The work on, he did on this is amazing. 
All right, so that is my review for the Red Dynasty playing cards from Brendan Hong. As always, we ask that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. If you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magic orthodoxy, twitter.com slash magic orthodoxy, instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy. And if you need more content, you can always find it at magic orthodoxy.com. Thanks. Bye.